Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I wanna thank you guys for coming over to check out this video. If you like this video, please subscribe over here or comment below for any of the toys that you like in this video. So this one here, this is a really fun one. My brother over the Christmas, uh, the holiday, he gave me a bunch of mystery Batman toys. What does that mean? It basically means that he sent me a bunch of these random things to, to unwrap. And then, you know, in, instead of just opening them up all on one day, I decided, you know what, I'm gonna open them once every day. I've been posting these on Instagram as stories, you know, if I wanted to put together a video that showed all of them. So let's just kind of go down the line. Uh, this one here, I actually opened that already. This one here is actually, it's this little scarecrow. This guy's pretty cool here. It's, it's like a little mini figure, right? Really nice. I like these ones because they're just kind of funny looking. Like a, this one is a really good Halloween one, so I like this one quite a lot. Uh, going down the line, I'm actually just gonna bring this over here. See, it's like a whole bag of Batman goodies in here, so it's pretty tight. Uh, this one here is a Batman Beyond toy. So for those of you who remember the TV show, Batman Beyond, uh, this is one of the toys. I love Batman Beyond, hence the shirt that I'm wearing, if you can kind of see it right here. Ooh, Batman Beyond. Yeah, so they really should make a movie on that one. Uh, another one here, we have the gold Batman. I think this is from Batman Returns. So this one's pretty cool. And usually they come with a cloth cape or something. I used to get these all the time. Like these these ones, they it, it's always the same Batman, but they just have different colored suits and that sort of thing. This one here, I don't know what it is, but it's a cool Batman. He has like this uh, underwater breathing apparatus he uses to, you know, that sort of thing. This is not Batman, this is actually Batgirl. The, the very first one I opened, it was actually this one here. So it's the, from the DC heroes. It's catered more towards uh, girls to buy their toys, you know. This one's actually pretty good. Like, I'm pretty surprised by the, how you can pose it and everything. Um, I'm not a big fan of the comic book. I think it's, it's I mean, it's, it's fun for kids, so, you know. Good if you have like a daughter, little stuff there. Uh, this next one here is from, it was used to be on the WB back when they used to have a network. Uh, this is the Batman for, from The Batman. So I have another one that I got from Ariana's parents. I have never opened that box, but this would go into that line over there. This one's cool because, you know, you can do the whole like, come at me, bro. All right, this is Batman number six. It's Aqua Batman. So this one's pretty cool. It's from the... Uh, it's like the animated series Batman back in the 90s. I used to buy these toys all the time because they had great accessories. So I call this one Jungle Batman or Electric Batman. This one's pretty cool here. So yeah, that's Jungle Batman right over there. Is this one here? It's from Batman Forever. So it has like little wings that come out. It's a it's a cool figure. You know, he flies around, and I like the the white and black look that he has going on. All right, so next to the Batman, this is a. Uh, I actually have this one already. It's the Night Quest Batman here. He doesn't have the cape. I don't have the cape on the other one either. I always liked this one as a kid because his armor was cool, but today the Nightwing armor is awful. <laughs> it's, it's a terrible armor today. So moving on to the next, another uh, Batman Nightwing. This one's pretty cool. It has uh, these like crazy wings. I mean, it's awful design, but this one is actually kind of cool because I like these demon wings that come out of his back. It's a more on the smaller scale, but it's, it's a cool one. I like the color. The red really pops nicely. And this one here is another Night Quest, Night, uh, Night Quest Batman here. Uh, this one's the smallest one. So we have this guy, which is the actual armor that Jean-Paul used. And this one here is more of a toy variant of it. And this one here is from the Legends of the, uh, Legends of Batman toy line, so I really like this toy line. I keep looking for these ones, so yeah. It's cool to get these uh, these like Night Quest Batman. And we're still going on. This is another Night Quest Batman. So I have this one already, complete with the gun and the cape and everything. I even have the card. I even have the card for it, so that's actually kind of funny. Um, this one is pretty over the top. It's another Night Quest Batman, Jean-Paul. Just a different color and everything. So that's four. And then we have this crazy looking Batman here. 
Uh, I'm not sure from whence this one is. I think it's, uh, must be like a Batman and Robin or Batman. I think it's probably Batman and Robin or Batman Forever, one of those. It's from that movie line. So it originally came with some sort of accessory, I'm sure, based on it, but I have no idea where it is, but it's cool. It's nice to just get these loose, fun figures here. All right, and from here we have a, another one. I, I don't know from what this line is either, but this is another Batman, kind of like a green, a, like almost like a teal. So it's probably, probably like a San Jose Sharks fan is what he is, you know? Oh, now this is a Batman that I really like. It's, it's like this purple one. Uh, it, he's like a pirate or something. So I definitely like this one. Like he, he can really only pose in one way, you know, but it's a cool pose. It's, I'm sure like he had a sword at one point. So this is a cool Batman here. I like how the cape is still on him, you know, and everything. It looks like maybe he goes underwater with his little mask. And the last one that he sent me was not actually a Batman toy. It was actually Rogue. He got me Rogue uh, from X-Men. So I am pretty, I was pretty jazzed. When I opened all of these up one by one, this was actually the very last one that I opened. So I was pretty damn surprised. I was thinking, oh, you know, it's gonna be another Batman, but this one's really nice. Um, most of the Marvel Legends are actually pretty good figures in terms of their posability. But in terms of their likeness from the characters, they're very hit or miss. Um, and they have just this terrible problem with the BAFs, the build of figures. I don't do those at all. But this one's really nice, even if you look at like, the hair detail in the back, it's it's exactly like the rogue that we all know and love. 90s, that kind of style. So I actually have this hanging out with uh, my, my Dark Phoenix Jean Grey and my Cyclops. And she's actually, she flies next to Jean Grey, which is actually pretty cool. So this is all the Batman figures. And there's a total of 16 Batman figures. That's 16 days of opening Batman mystery bags. It was pretty fun. Like, it, it, like if you if you know somebody who's into like comics and stuff, just go to flea markets and just get some Batman action figures or whatever figures. They're they're pretty cheap, and you can probably just like put them on together and say like, oh, here's the mystery bag of characters. So to my brother, I'll fail. This was a great gift. Thank you. Like it made January all the more fun because usually January, it's pretty boring. I just play video games all day. So it was pretty fun. Just like every single day to open open one toy up. Okay, so with all those toys and everything, you know, for the compilation, now we gotta figure out like, what is the best toy that I got out of that? So, I mean, honestly, the best toy I got was obviously Rogue. Like, Rogue is the winner here. It's a, it's a great figure. I've always wanted to collect more X-Men, but you know, it's kind of a money pit to collect all the X-Men. Um, but that's kind of cheating, right? So, like, well, which one of the Bat characters do I like the most? So, easily, I think that the, my favorite one is actually this Scarecrow, and it's cheating again because it's technically not Batman, but I just like minifigures. Minifigures are really cool. You can put them next to each other. They don't take too much room. Yeah, so so more often than not, these ones here I like collecting because they're tiny. They're really easy to store. You know, you can if when you're done collecting them, you literally just put them in a shoebox. They don't take up a lot of space. Um, but if we want to get into the Batman, then it's hard to choose, but I got to pick like one of these two here. So I love this one because I like the color of it and I like these like massive wings. This one would be a really cool one to play with as a kid because since he's smaller, he could just fit in your pocket, you know, and he's pretty poseable. Like this one's a really good one for playing. Uh, but in terms of like the style, I really like this purple one because again, it's the color. Like I really like, if when you get the color right on a Batman figure, you know, those are the ones that appeal to me the most. And especially if you're a kid, like, the colors are going to be what, what gives it to you. But this one also has the character of him with his sword that's going on and his side. Um, and he, he even has the cape. Not a lot of these actually have the capes for any of these. So that's why these two here are my favorite Batman figure. So that's my video guys for the mystery Batman of the holidays that my brother Alfeo sent me. Uh, that was really fun. And if you like this video and you want to see more, please comment below and subscribe here. And also follow me on my Instagram at little underscore nerd underscore busters. Until next time, guys. Adios.